Just recently, CTP announced the changes to vehicles coming up in 1.7, or perhaps 1.8. Tanks lost a few slots, and both dropships and tanks became more hit and run. Long periods of vulnerability follow after our modules are worn off. If AV was not adjusted to match the changes, we'd be unable to field our new vehicles. Current AV would be just too strong. CCP have just announced the changes to grenades and swarms. Let me tell you what they are, and why the swarm launcher players are upset, and why they should be ashamed of themselves for being upset. So far there are two changes. Lock-on range has dropped from 400 meters to 175 meters. Missile damage is down from 330 hit points a missile to 220 hit points. This is Manus Peak Skirmish. This is the red line, the south team, that is attacking from B, C and cannot enter. This is the old lock-on range of 400 meters for a swarm launcher standing behind A in the red line, all safe and cosy. As you see from this spot, he can cover every single objective on the map. Tanks and lads get some cover, but for dropships we're easily hittable from this spot, any time we try to get anywhere near any objective. 400 meter lock-on gives him full map coverage from inside the red line. This is ridiculously overpowered. Here is the new lock-on range. It's going to be 175 meters. Notice the swarm launcher can cover a single objective, using his weapon for point defense, rather than map defense. What if he does the unlikely and ventures from the red line, and moves to, say, the tower behind C? From here he can no longer cover A, but he can cover C, and B is just about in his range. But B is not enough in his range that he can stop a dropship delivering behind the warehouse, or a tank sneaking up behind it, but he can fully defend C, which is where he is. This new lock-on range means that the player can fully defend a point, but not shoot the whole map from the red line. This means that vehicles that now have to retreat after an attack can actually move out of range of the AV player to repair. This looks balanced with the vehicle changes to me. Swarms can protect the space they are in to defend a point or assist the team to take the point, but they actually have to get up and go there now. Pilot or tank player can also use skill to move out of range and play his role without Swarms chasing him anywhere he might be on the map. If any swarmers watch this who think the old 400 meter range was right, then I'm embarrassed for you. Your weapon was broken. Locking missiles that auto track after launch and full map coverage from the red line is not balanced. If you think it was, then I can only assume you don't want an interesting battle, just easy mode wins.